Close your eyes and watch your breath. Try to stay with the breath in spite of any other distraction that may come in. The sound of the birds, the sound of other people, thoughts that come in. You've got to let them go because you've got work to do. Try to get the mind to get more under your control so you can watch it and so it doesn't go off and create a lot of trouble for you. We want to understand the mind, get some control over the mind so it can stop creating suffering for itself. That's our big duty. And all too often we let ourselves get distracted by other things. This is why one of the perfections is equanimity. Now, equanimity doesn't mean that we're just indifferent to everything. What it means is that we have to figure out what's top priority and what's not, and focus all our attention and all of our energy on what is top priority for us and let the other things go. Because a lot of things in the world, they're not the way they should be. But if you go around trying to straighten everything out, you end up not straightening yourself out, and the work is never done. You have to realize that there's some things that simply because of people's karma just aren't going to change. And if you waste a lot of energy trying to change them, then you've wasted the energy that you could have put into your duties. Because the main thing you are responsible for is the fact that your mind is creating suffering, and when you create suffering for yourself, you've got create burden, creating burdens for other people. The people can't take of their own suffering, but they can start weighing other people down. So to be a light burden on the world, to be a light burden on yourself, you've got to focus on what is your main duty. As for things outside of your control, that's what you develop equanimity for. You've got to maintain your focus on what's really important. And so we have goodwill for all beings, but it doesn't mean we can go out and help all beings. There are a lot of beings in the world that are going to suffer, regardless. There's some good you can do outside, and if you can, go ahead and do it. But if you realize it's something you can't do, or you're not getting anywhere, okay, you've got to drop it, because where you do have to get some places in the training of your mind. And if you find that you're not getting anywhere there, okay, you've really got to put extra effort and extra energy into being more and more focused on this, because this is your main duty. Otherwise, we just keep going through life again and again and again, creating more and more suffering for ourselves and the people around us, and it doesn't accomplish anything. Whereas if you take care of this one problem inside, okay, you've taken a burden off the world, you've taken a burden off your mind. But it requires that you be focused. It requires that you give this work your top priority. So try to stay focused right here. As for everything else, develop some equanimity. And that way the work that needs to be done does get done. And then if you have extra energy left over, you're happy to share it. But make sure that the number one job gets finished.